Hello, my name is Al Zuccotti of Zuccotti Corp. What we see here is a version one of my hack of the Disneyland Galaxy's Edge Holocron Jedi Edition. And what I've done is I've taken the electronics out of the shell and I've configured them in such a way that you can read all kyber crystals, sealed or unsealed, in their tubes. The Force is what gives the Jedi his power. It's an energy field created by all living things. It surrounds us, it penetrates us, it binds the galaxy together. The Jedi Code forbids emotional attachments to individuals, but it's wrong to say we are not allowed to care. Rather, we care about a principle larger than any one person. So you can see it performs exactly like a standard holocron from retail. However, there is one difference I discovered in the way I've got this sucker wired. You can turn it off and then turn it back on again and it will retain the last scan that you performed. So clear it just as easily and get it back to the empty or stock holocron. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen, with the dark shadow of the Empire rising to take their place. And then, of course, it will turn itself off after the default period of time, just like the standard holocron. We can turn it off, make sure it's cleared. And then it will charge, just like the original, with its USB cable. So basically what you have here is an external scanning unit that will let you scan before you open any tube that the Jedi Holocron would ordinarily read, which is all the colors except for red and black. So, that's the Jedi Holocron uh, version 1, Zuccotti Corp Hack. This is Hal Zuccotti, and it's been my pleasure to show you this.